All right, so I'm back at the spot that I think the last video we posted was in the same spot. We put the boat out here. It was the first time we'd ever been here. We caught five good red bellies and a perch. We tried to go upstream with the boat when we first put out, and it's not possible. The river gets real small. There's a ton of trees in the water, but the bank looked pretty clear. So I'm back out here today by myself. Going to see if I can't walk the bank up there where the river's small, see if I can't catch a red belly. The water's dropped. Looks like about a foot, a lot. It came down a bunch since then. That was probably a week and a half ago. So, uh, see what we can do. Man, it's kind of crazy how much it's dropped since the last time we was out here. Didn't feel like it was that long ago. Well, this little beetle spin with the legs. I like the beetle spins with the legs. I kind of forgot about them for a little while there. I ain't used them since last year. Got a whole bunch of different colors in my pocket. This is the one I'm starting out with. Starting out by throwing over a tree. Ooh, guy, I had one for a second. Something just smoked something right there. I think I had a stick on there. I was not paying attention. Something just killed a bug right there. I probably should have threw top water on here. Too late now. Get it right in that corner where he was. Yep, got him too. A bass. <laughs> I seen him smoke something off top. It's not what I was after, but hey, look at that. First fish of the day. Quit it, dude. Six pound test and a beetle spin. Swat, he downed that beetle spin. Look at that. First fish. I'm pretty sure I had a bite while I was looking at this one hitting that bug over there not a bad first catch got him that's gonna be one right there just a small red belly but a good one for the cooler good eating size one first keeper fish of the day could have kept that bass, but I'm not big on keeping bass, so. Pretty one, though. Just your average size. No way. Dude, I snatched it out of a tree. And it fell at my feet. And when I reeled the slack up, there was a big mudfish on. It was laying at my feet. He picked it up off bottom. He's probably going to take my beetle spin. Maybe not. I only got six pound test. Hooked him in the lips too, so I'll probably get him in. Good one though. Come on, dude. If, I would have, if he would have swallowed it, I would have lost him. They got some teeth on him. Come on, big fella. You know you're tired. Probably, probably gonna be the biggest fish I catch today. Oh! Come on, brother. Oh. Splashing me. You done yet? That's a pretty dang good mudfish right there. Yeah, barely got him hooked. That is a stud, too. My hook's bending. Oh, you're strong. He's gonna flop out my hands, I already know it. Look at that guy. The stud. Six pound test. <laughs> that is a strong fish. He's gonna flop out my hands any second. I'm barely holding him. Maybe not. Mouth full of teeth. Usually you lose your beetle spans, you hook one that big. Got lucky that time.
There he is. Another red belly. Another one that's not really a giant, but a good keeper. These yellow flies are eating me up. I was looking down waiting for a yellow fly to land. I was going to swat him. And he bit. Two decent red bellies so far. No big ones yet. There he is. That's a good one, too. It's got to be a good red belly. Come on. Come on, be a rooster. It is. Well, he ain't too crazy, but he's still a good one. Biggest one so far. He smoked it. Let's go getting a beautiful mess of fish today. Ain't been here real long. I think we've caught three different species so far, too. This is the one we after, though. Little green beetle spin with legs. Catches a little bit of everything. As soon as I started talking good about that beetle spin, I lost it on a vine, so I changed it to this color. It's got a yellowish tint to it, but it's more of a like pale white with a yellow tint. A couple different colors speckled on there. Still got the legs on it. I've caught fish on this one before. We'll see if they want it. There's another one. Oh, that's a good one too. Come here, fella. Some fine red bellies in here, man. They liking this beetle spin. Or these beetle spins. Second different color I've used. But I did just put this one on. Already got another one. Gonna have a good mess of them today. Still no big ones. Probably one right here in this still spot. Yeah. As soon as it hit the water, it's gotta be a bass. If it ain't, that's a big old red belly. It's a bass. Like I said. Apparently the bass are biting today too. It didn't even, I didn't even move it. As soon as I tossed it in there. Not a bad little bass. That's two. On beetle spins. Solid ones too, really. There he is. I was about to pull that out of the water. <laughs> All these red bellies are the same size. I really expected to catch at least a few roosters by now. Last time we came out here, that's all we caught. Just a bunch of good keeper size red bellies. I mean, I ain't gonna complain. Solid size ones. Good eating size ones. Pretty fish. There he is, running too. Come on, another red belly. Catching most of them in the middle. Not bad. Bunch of stumps right there. Probably a bass laying on it. Didn't quite get it up there next to it. Let's see what's there. Perfect. Nothing. Probably catch one in the middle. Like I said, in the middle. <laughs> Where these red bellies been hanging out. That one's a little bit bigger than the other ones. Not by a lot, but a little bit. Got a nice mess of fish already. Been fishing for a little while now, but not that long. They're biting pretty good on these beetle fans. Another one. Killing it. Yeah, they definitely liked the white one a little bit better. Pretty good size to that one. I don't even know how many I got now. Didn't really expect to catch this many, honestly. We came in a boat in this river and only caught six. 
Now, all six of them was bigger than the ones in that cooler. Five. All five of them was bigger. But there's another one. He's biting way better today. Just tearing them up. That was two casts. Just roping them. Another one. That's three casts. I probably got a few in the cooler this size already, but I don't really, I didn't really want but about 10 of them. So we got nine in there. I should have been a little pickier, I guess. They've all been solid size though. That one right there was a keeper, but he would have been the smallest one in the cooler. That was three casts in a row I caught a fish. That's pretty wild. That ain't happened while burning fishing in a while for me. There's another one. This spot right here is killer. That one's even smaller though. Still, right here with those logs all the way across the river. Somebody tried to saw it. Didn't quite make it through. That's four fish in this one spot though. That's pretty crazy. On a beetle span too. I lost my white beetle spin. <laughs> that was a fish too. That was a fish. Probably mud fish because it snapped off pretty instantly. Unless I had a bad knot, which, nah, had to have been a mud fish. Or just I had some frays on my line because it snapped off as soon as I set the hook. Oh well. Well, it looks like. <laughs> looks like I'm about to get rained out. Looks like it's about to get pretty ugly out here. I caught 11 red bellies, I think. I kept nine of them, and I think I threw two back. So there's nine in the cooler, caught two bass, and I caught a big old mudfish. So it was a pretty good day fishing by myself. I didn't fish but probably three hours. That one walk down the bank till I lost all my beetle spins that I toted with me. Went to go to the next spot, and it's about to get ugly. Hope y'all liked the video. Thank y'all for watching.